Hey guys, so today's video is going to be a haul and it's with my favorite store ever, Princess Polly Boutique. If you guys don't already know, all I gotta say is if you check it out, you're gonna want a lot of stuff. Every time I'm on their site, I get a ton of style inspiration and I just want everything. But I do have quite a few things I wanted to share with you guys that I got from them. And I have a coupon code as well for 20% off. And it is VV20. Let's go ahead and just get started with the video. Alrighty. So, okay, let's start with clothes. So I'm going to start off with some dresses. I'm actually wearing one right now, which I will show you what it looks like. And I just love the way this fits. It's so comfy. This material is just so... Just you put it on and it feels like wearing nothing and I love the color and the little cute polka dots and the straps are like scrunchy elastic so they're really comfortable on. A lot of times with these dresses they're very just like on you like just fabric on you but there is a purpose with like an elastic right here you can't really see it but it cinches right here which I always really really like in um, clothing design because I'm not a very tall person, so I get lost in fabric really easily, but when you have that little like elastic or something cinching at the waist, it kind of makes it so that you see some sort of figure on me. Um, so I really, really like that. And this material also gives you nice little booty because it's a pattern, and it like jiggles when you walk. So if you like that, <laughs> then that's a thing. Wow, not even two minutes into the video and I already twerked for you guys. <laughs> Alright, so next dress is this one here and it's white. I am obsessed with white dresses. I just feel like they're so pretty with like little gold jewelry and with your hair just like with a little wave. It's very beachy um, and just like, I just love the look of it. Very crisp. So yeah, this is what it looks like the entire back is like kind of that elastic fabric like in um the like lower part of a shirt or something but this is actually the entire back so it really kind of pulls everything you have a little kind of like corset looking um boob area and then you tie it and then you have these off the shoulder straps with ruffles that are really really feminine and cute so next i want to show you this play suit which is also white uh, once again i just love how clean white like dresses and play suits and um shirts and stuff are because you can really wear them with anything and they look really good with them. i just love how like carefree it is but you could still wear it to like a like a formal thing like a date or um something a little bit more than casual uh, the only thing is this fit is a little bit too big for me. I did get the smallest size. It's just a little long on me in the torso area. So because of that, the shorts kind of um, cut off at a weird place. It's a little loose. Um, I am really short. I'm 5'2". So I feel like it's made for someone a little taller. Um, but I can make it work by kind of just like tucking in at the waist so the shorts pull up and the torso isn't as long and um, kind of loose. But do keep in mind if you are shorter, that is something. If you are taller, it's I'm sure going to be like perfect. All right, next I'm going to show you guys. Um, let's see here. I'm going to show you guys some tops. So the first top is this one here, and I am obsessed with this. It's so freaking cute. It's so simple, but I don't have anything like it. I love the little skinny straps and then in the middle you have uh, these little ties and that way it's just like a little bit of skin showing but it's not like total boob is out. It's just a little cute little uh, like sexy uh, touch to the shirt and then um, the bottom is ruffled and it's not too too cropped which I really really like. It hits kind of at the perfect place on my stomach where I can wear high rise things without having to tuck and um, fold up but it's not too cropped where like I have like too much skin showing um, and I actually I wore it as a halter but there are little things in the back for you to I'm guessing like like 
X in the back and tie so you have instead of a halter but it um, crosses over in the back but I like the way it looks just as a halter so I did that but I know that that is an option if you don't want to wear it as a halter and that's the thing with Princess Polly is what really sets them apart for me and clothing is that their designs are super 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 cute but it's not just like it looks cute online it also looks cute in person because I know a lot of online boutiques the quality just isn't there but these things actually like are what I expect them to be in person and they fit really really well and I rarely I don't even think I've ever had anything I've bought from Princess Polly where I've been like that's not what I expected so I absolutely just love everything they have so yeah, I love this top. Then I have this top here, and it's by the brand Afens. I am Princess Polly carries a ton of their stuff, um, and I love how like this is kind of like nostalgic. It reminds me of something you'd wear like in the 70s, and it's really simple. Also, not super cropped, which I like. And then it does have adjustable straps. And it's thick enough where you don't have to wear a bra if you don't want, which I like. And then I like to pair it with these shorts, which I will show you guys later. But this is kind of like a look I was going for. Next top I'm going to show you guys is an oversized t-shirt. And it just looks like this. It has a cobra on it. And it says poison. And it's just like a really cool graphic tee. And it is an oversized t-shirt, so if you um want it to be larger this fit is not as oversized as i would hope so i would probably have sized up because i was expecting it to be almost like enough where i don't have to wear like pants or shorts or if i did it'd be completely covered but it did hit me at a point where i did have to wear biker shorts and they were showing and i wish like they weren't showing as much so i would have prob probably sized up but that's just my preference um but I still like love the t-shirt. Honestly, will go with so many things. And yeah, I thought it was just really cool looking. So I'm happy about that. And I'll definitely like style it a lot of different ways. So I'm excited for that. All right, next I'm going to show you guys some bottoms I got. So as I mentioned before, these bottoms here go with this shirt. And yeah once again very like nostalgic 70s vibe with the corduroy and this color especially um i don't know i just it's really unique and i freaking love it these are so comfortable and yeah i got a size us 4 australian 8 and they fit me really well there's that and then next i have this skirt which i styled with the black top and this is definitely a skirt I would wear out to the club. This print is very um, eye-catching. I just love like the detail in this print. It looks really, really good. It's almost like a pleather material. Yeah, I really, really like this skirt. I got it in a size 6. Alright, so that's basically it for all the clothes. I got a ton of shoes. I've been trying to think of things that would go well for every day, but I also got some pairs of shoes that I was like, I can, I'm going to Coachella this year, so I'm kind of already starting to think about different outfits. So I got some um, shoes that I envisioned outfits for for Coachella, so I'm excited to show you guys those. My hair keeps bothering me because I didn't style today, and I never know which way to part it, but I'm just gonna just leave it. <laughs> All right, so first pair of shoes are these sneakers, and I am obsessed with these. I've been wanting a pair of just all white um, leather shoes just because I love white shoes so much, but I get them dirty really fast, so I feel like leather is a little bit easier to clean and take care of and just looks super good and put together. And um, I haven't laced them all up, but you get the idea. These are slightly platform, and it's the brand Superga um, in a size... 36 so that's a us 6 and yeah i just know these are definitely shoes i can throw on um with pretty much any outfit very casual every day or even with like a dress would be really really cute too so um yeah really excited to style these so next is another pair of sneakers that are not every day in fact, I know that's like a really big trend right now, and I will have to say 
I honestly would always see these shoes on Instagram and be like, those are so ugly. But do you ever like have something and it like is ugly but cute? This is my thoughts on these shoes. So these are like the dad shoes basically, really chunky, thick, just kind of gaudy honestly, but in the best way possible. And so I really envisioned these in a Coachella outfit. I just personally could not rock these up and down the street. Kudos to you if you can, but they are literally like three inch platforms and like super chunky. But so cute. Um, so yeah, I think it's really cute to style in like a street, um, street wear type of outfit. And I don't know, they might grow on me, and you might see me wearing these around Target one day. But <laughs> for now, definitely gonna be Coachella. Very excited. Um, I don't like all the shoes in this style. These ones really caught my eye because they're all white, so they're not super like in your face. But, I mean they are but they're all white which is like my favorite just white sneakers in general are my favorite thing ever so I'm excited to wear these all right next are these Doc Martens I've never owned a pair of Doc Martens in my life but I saw these and I was like those are something I can really picture myself wearing so I probably I'm gonna end up wearing these to Coachella but these are what they look like. I know the traditional Doc Martens just had the laces, but I love the little buckles. I know Princess Polly had the same style, but like a little higher. So I liked how these were lower because I can wear them with more outfits just like every day. Um, I styled them like this in this outfit and I love that look. And so, yeah, these are the Doc Martens I got. Super excited. All right, next pair of shoes are these beauties. I don't know, I'm just obsessed with these. I love the multicolored leather, and they're so comfortable because they're platform. And I can just imagine wearing these in the summer with some um, shorts. And I really love like this outfit together with the corduroy and the tank top. I feel like it's very 70s, this entire look. I'm living for it. So. Yeah, obsessed with these. Been eyeing them for a while, so I'm really happy I got them. Um, yeah. And this is actually a size 37. I'm usually a 36, and they fit just fine. So if you are... I feel like these shoes, you can get away with getting a little bit bigger, just because they're not super constraining. Um, constraining a word? Restraining? Something like that. And I will definitely wear these out a lot when it starts getting warmer. All right, next, moving on to accessories. So I got two little bags. The first one is this one here, and it has this really pretty bird. I think it's a crane. <laughs> and um, I love the strap it came with. I don't know, it just really caught my eye. It's a velvet material with gold hardware, and the inside is just like a pouch. Next, I have this crochet bag, also very, very small just for the necessities and just easy to kind of add to any boho outfit, and it has a little pulley like that, little wooden beads. I just thought it was really cute for a little laid back look with like a simple dress, even like this or something like that. It reminds me of like Bali. I'm waiting for my Postmates right now, so I think she's almost here. I'm excited to eat. I'm so hungry. All right, moving on to more accessories. So I got this belt. Princess Polly has some of my favorite belts ever. I feel like a belt just really puts together an outfit. So I got this one here, which has a gold little circle, or kind of medium-sized circle, actually. And then these holes, which are gold as well. And then I got these glasses, which I was really excited because I feel like it's not too crazy, but it's still stylish. So, yeah. And then it is a kind of green tint lens with gold frames, and it fits and sits really well on my nose, which is a huge issue for a lot of glasses I buy. I don't have a very high nose bridge, so I really like it when glasses have these 
little um, like nose grip thingies because that way it's not sitting right on my face and it doesn't slide down or mess up my makeup. So these are definitely staying put, which I appreciate. All right, next are some gold jewelry pieces. The first one is this necklace here, which has these um, shells. They're not real shells, but they look like shells and they're gold with a little seashell at the bottom. And then I got some earrings. The first ones here kind of like have a coin looking thing in gold with little tiny hoops. And then these earrings here which have these little crosses on um, these dangling chains. So it's a nice little pop of gold that I really like. And then I'm actually wearing a bracelet right now that I just got from Princess Polly. And it has this little like constellation star thing and little just beads or circles or whatever all throughout. And it's a two layer bracelet. I uh, Oh, lastly, I got this um, headband turban thing. I thought it would just be super cute when my hair is like messy at the beach or something. Having a little texture and wave and putting something like this in your hair I think is really, really cute. And I never really do it, but I feel like I should do with my hair, like accessories and stuff like that, just because I love the way it looks on other people. So I want to try to start doing like things like that. So this is super cute and kind of keeps my hair out of my face too. So yeah, that's basically it for this haul. I hope that you guys enjoyed it enjoyed it, and liked the things that I chose. Um, but yeah, be sure to check out the description. I'll be linking everything I just showed you. Also, coupon code is VV20 for 20% off. Be sure to use that if you do end up buying anything. But yeah, thank you so much for watching this video. Hope you're having a wonderful day.